Next, we have the uses of coding in AIS. So, concisely represent large amounts of complex information that would otherwise be unmanageable. It provides a means of accountability over the completeness of the transactions process. Identify unique transactions and accounts within a file. And support the audit function by providing an effective audit trail. So, there are different kinds of codes. So, we have this sequential coding wherein it represents items in sequential order, used to pre-number source documents, track each transaction process, identify any out-of-sequence documents, and then it says advantages is arbitrary information and hard to make changes and insertions. So, sequential, ang uh, nagamit og sequential codes, for instance, ka nang makita ninyo sa mga checks, di ba? Checks have check numbers. Ang kanang mga check numbers is nakasequence na siya. So, for instance, kaninga checkbook is from 001 to 0, uh, 050. So, kana siya, mahibawa ni mo nga Um, if na isawan gani ka check nga masayup ka, di ba? Example na kay error nga ma encounter sa check number 10, dili na na mo siya ma-change. Mahug na jud nga kana check number 10 is recognize na siya as cancelled check. Ingon na so naka-sequence yun ni mo so dapat kabaw ka kabaw ka sa uni mo pagpangita ang mga datas or ang ang document kung asa na napunta ang kanan na document kay naa mang good say or pre-numbered man siya. Kana po mga sales order, mga purchase order, those are pre-numbered so source documents. So, kasagaran, makita na ninyo, kana mga makalahi dyan na siya color, kana sa mga makared na siya kasagaran, kana mga invoice number, collection receipts number, so th those make use of sequential codes. Masking ka na resibo ninyo, kana mga digital na resibo na sa mga POS, like sa mga Jollibee, so, if tanaw na nimo na na siya yung mga um, sales invoice number, oh, so, kana siya is sequential, gaya na siya. Next, we have the block code. So, they represent whole classes by assigning each class a specific range within the coding scheme. Used for chart of accounts or the basis of the general ledger and allows for the easy insertion of new codes within a block so don't have to reorganize the coding structure and then this advantage is arbitrary information so sa block codes if makuha mo na sa inyong chart of accounts for instance all assets kay sugod good yung a number is 1 all liabilities kay 2 owners equity kay 3 um, uh, income kay 4 expenses kay 5 so yun na na siya then mag, yan na magsugnod nga basta 1 ang pinakauna na digit and then If the second digit is 1, it refers to a cash. Second digit is 2, it refers to a accounts receivable. So, ina na siya ba? Naka-block siya. Marag na assign code ang kind number ba? Now, if ever gani, for instance, isa po si cash, di ba? 1, cash. Then, kung ma-specify pa dito ang bank, so, put na sa natog ika-third nga digit. So, isa po kung cash in bank sa Metro Bank, so, ang code na niya pa is 113. Kaya, di ba? 3 na is katong for Metro Bank, or 1 for BDO, 2 for BPI, 3 for Metro Bank. So, kung mutanaw ka sa imuhang account title for cash in bank in BPI, so, ang iyang code is 112. So, ana siya ba? Naka-block ko siya. Siya mo na dali ang imuhang insertion. Punan raman niyo sa katong kinalasan. Next is group codes. They represent complex items or events involving two or more pieces of data using fields with specific meanings. For example, a coding scheme for tracking sales might be 0409 So, kani is na yung meaning. Oh. Kani is ka na mga pag dinagkuay, nagigid ka yung company or mga multinational companies with a lot of locations. Ano ba ron? So, awa na siya specific code for the store number. Lahay po ang code sa ihan department number. Then, napay code sa sale number. Napay code sa kung kinsa ang salesperson. So, ano siya? Nagi group codes na siya. Then, disadvantage Stage, arbitrary information, and then is overused. Next, we have the alphabetic code. So, used for many of the same purposes as numeric codes and can be assigned sequentially or used in block and group 
coding techniques may be used to represent large numbers of items. They can represent up to 26 variations per field. And disadvantage is arbitrary information. So, kanilang is nagamit kag letters. Batangan na niyo A, B, C, anara. So, yung sabay, imong code is instead of kani, at the store, pwede nga, instead ang imong hang store code, kay instead of number, pwede store A, store B, C, D, so, ana siya. Muna siya ang sa imong alphabetic codes. Next, we have the mnemonic code. Alphabetic characters used as abbreviations, acronyms, and other types of combinations. So, do not require users to memorize the meaning since the code itself is informative and not arbitrary. So, for example, NY is equals to New York. And disadvantages is limited usability and availability. So, that ends chapter 2.